Alright, well, I guess we'll jump straight into some news here. Start news off. We got a really uh, interesting thing that's happening on the Japan Xbox Marketplace. <laughs> um, Kingdom Hearts 3, the game that, you know, I didn't even know was in Japan, apparently isn't in Japan right now. <laughs> Uh, it was on the Xbox One Marketplace in Japan, and it just vanished. Out of trace. An error code comes up, you know, where there's like one of the fucking Xbox avatars just like, ooh, like <laughs> doing one of those, and it just has like a little message. It's like, hey, fuck you, you know, basically. And it's just, it's not there. Uh, interestingly enough, in the States, on uh, Xbox One's Marketplace, uh, it is on their listed as coming soon okay so we're apparently still gonna get it i don't know when yet but it's it's there as you know hey it's on its way <laughs> i know it's gonna it's gonna piss people off but i don't care at this point i don't either yeah. i know my wife is gonna play the shit out of it i'm gonna sit there and just be like huh look at that she says that but it may not be as good as she thinks it's gonna be you know, when it's already been in development as almost as long as Duke Nukem Forever was. And that's not good. When you have a game that's in development for like 12 plus fucking years, like, you gotta think, it's already gone through two different systems where they had to upscale it, re-res it, redesign all this shit. It, people are gonna be burnt out. They don't, they're not gonna give know, a shit about story. And you know the same group of people are not working, it's not the exact same group of people that started working on it mm -hmm. at this point, just for various reasons. So it's going to be handed through multiple people, so you know the original vision might be altered and changed. I did not like any of the Kingdom Hearts stuff after 2. Um, nah. <clears throat> I, I didn't play it all, I'll be honest, I didn't play them all, but the ones that I did play... They were crap. They did not feel like... Was it Rechain that had the card system or whatever? Chain of Memories and Rechain of Memories, which was the PS2 port. That was terrible. Um, they both had the card system. That was terrible. I'm like, what was wrong with what we were doing? Why we had to put... It was such a drastic change to go from an action RPG style to strategy-based card battle. Yeah. It was I thought really it was weird. It was really funny, too, like, <clears throat> in that game, how they made it that way. They're like, all your weapons are gone in this universe. We fight with cards. I'm like, uh, come again? <laughs> did you just take $50 from me and give me this bullshit? Is that what you just did to me? Yes, we did. Fuck you. Yeah. Thank you for investing in this franchise that you once loved. <laughs> yeah. I, <clears throat> it's just funny when this kind of stuff happens where, like, something will get accidentally put up in the marketplace, sometimes for free when it's not supposed to be, a la Fallout 4, uh, and then get, like, all of a sudden disappear real quickly. <laughs> uh, you know, it's just, it's, it's really funny because you get to see this stuff in, like, real time. Because you, you, back in the day, it's not like Toys R Us would put the game out on the shelf and then, like, the next day it would be gone. <laughs> You'd be, like, with this, like, a coming soon. I'm like, well, it was just here... Yesterday, they put it out, and then the guy goes back to the counter, and he's like looking at his stuff of what he's supposed to put out. He's like, "Oh, that's not till next week. <laughs> Why do we even have it? Why do we have it then? Why can we sell it if it's not? Yeah. You... Well, I should just put it away then. And he's just like taking it down, and his kids already bought it, and they're going home. I'm like, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm like, well, so we are. We actually sold some. And the companies were like. We've got a contingency. Don't worry about it. They hang up. They look over. There's just like a train of ninjas standing there. And they're like, you know what to do. Arkansas. <laughs> That's all they say. Yeah. yeah. And then they just like jump out the window and they're in an actual like floating helicraft carrier. It's just like. <laughs> Tell me before I kill you. <laughs> the fallout 4 thing it's just like who's in charge <laughs> of putting this shit up and doing it properly like did you pick the worst person possible 
<laughs> you know, it's like at the Microsoft Japanese like area. It's like okay, they like put it down. They're like, make sure this game does not release <laughs> <laughs> for two more months. And the guy's like, two minutes. Got it. <laughs> it's like, no, no. <laughs> Two months, <laughs> minutes. <laughs> you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> Just walk off. And the guy actually puts like a timer on it. He's like, okay, we will not release. That's one of those like egg timers. <laughs> I'm a good employee. <laughs> oh, it's good to be plucked. Oh, it's good. <laughs> Don't want to be too early. <laughs> That'd be bad. <laughs> and then it's like the fallout guys. It's like, what happened there either, too? They're like, yeah. all right, well, we're in this, they're in this meeting. They're just like shuffling papers around. They're like, all right, now, top of the meeting. Uh, we have some DLC coming out soon. Uh, let's make the release date, you know, da 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 Johnson, you'll be ahead of uh, putting that on. You and your team. He's like, yes, sir. And he like, he's like leaving. And he gets to his desk and he's like, Ah, I love coffee. <laughs> oh, shit. What was the date? And he's just like, he finds one paper and it has like tomorrow's date on it. He's like, well, I guess that has to be it. But I don't have a price. <laughs> How much is it? Well, oh, free. <laughs> I set that up and bam. Yes. They can't yell at me for putting the wrong price down. I'm not putting anything down. <laughs> <sighs> Almost lost my job there. <laughs> Be a shame if we didn't give away this entire free DLC. <laughs> Imagine if we charged for it. That'd be bad. <laughs> it's like the date comes in, just like, like <laughs> the fucking president wakes up. He's like, "All right, well, we'll just go see what's going on in our market." What the <laughs> fuck, <laughs> Johnson? Johnson <laughs> It's like, honestly, it wasn't my fault, sir. It was the coffees. <laughs> We're going to have to have you uh, <laughs> talk to the uh, Japanese division of uh, Kingdom Hearts 3 and ask them what happened. <laughs> I was very early. <laughs> Which is bad. <laughs> but you gave away for free. <laughs> very stupid. <laughs> I don't feel as bad. <laughs> oh, my God. I, I'm with you. When this game comes out, it's just going to be one of the, it's. It, I feel like it's going to have the equivalency effect of a hot fart on the gaming industry. <laughs> it's going to like, it's going to announce itself. Everybody's going to know it's there for a little while. They're going to be like, yeah, I'm reveling in it. It's here. There's nothing I can do about it. Let's just deal with it and wait for it to go away. <laughs> and then it will just eventually leave, and it'll be like it was there and gone, and that was it. Like. And I can see this almost going like one of those things where it's going to be so anticipated, but by the time we get it, it's just like, eh, it's okay. Yeah. It's not better than two. I mean, one's still my favorite. It's like, yeah, well, everybody's going to say that. One actually had a level in the sea that you played a fucking level. <laughs> <laughs> that always kills you. I hated it. I'm like, why is this here? Why am I playing I'm playing Dance Dance Revolution in the fucking ocean with Ariel and Sebastian. I'm fucking like music goddamn tip tapping bullshit. <laughs> like what was was the Ursula fight? That was just too good in the first one. They're like, wow, we can't top that, so we'll just do something stupid. I'll take your sixty dollars now, please. <laughs> oh, whatever. I don't give a shit. And when it comes out, fine. Whatever. My wife will play it. I'll watch it. I'll just be like, okay, that's great. And it, it'll just, it'll go to the wayside. Like everything else does nowadays. True. There's only a few games that I know of that still hold, they like hold on and people still talk about to this very day. And you know what? Those were games that were written well, came out on fucking time, and didn't wait 12 goddamn years to put a sequel out. Yeah. Hmm. Mm. Whatever. Fuck Kingdom Hearts 3. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if you hate me for saying it, but. But whatever, it's not a it's not a staple in the gaming community anymore. It was when it was relevant. Let's put it that People way. People moved on. Yeah. 
You know, you, this game has been teased since PS fucking 2. And I almost moved on from Last Guardian until this past E3, where they're <laughs> like, here's the fucking release date. Yeah. We finally got an okay. We finished it. And even still, I'm just like, eh. What about Shadow of the Colossus 2? <laughs> <laughs> That's what everybody really wants. <laughs> That's the money shot. That's the <laughs> money shot. <laughs> Those giant monsters. That's the money shot. <laughs>